Hello guys, welcome back. My name is Asmarant and this is more 49ers news. Now, sorry I haven't been uh, uploaded recently. It's my birthday Monday. No lies. Birthday Monday. Drunk Monday night. Tuesday. Ill. Wednesday. Saw friends and family. Not as bad today, but I'm here to do some news. I've got to keep you up, keep you going. And let's get on with the first news bit. And this one's pretty interesting to me. So, as you can see by the article, nfl.com forward slash news. Uh, it's by Grant Gordon, uh, who did the article. Eagles sign former 49ers quarterback Nick Mullins. So this is interesting. So, it's only a little short one. And there it is. Through, uh, through uh, the Eagles already have themselves a veteran, quarter, uh, veteran backup, Joe Falco, behind the uh, upstart second-year quarterback Jalen Hurts. They've added some more experience to the fold. The Eagles have signed former... 49ers quarterback Nick Mullins, the team announced Monday morning. Across three seasons with the 49ers, Mullins played in 19 games with 16 starts filling in for an injured Jimmy G. Uh, and produced a 5-11 five, uh, five record as a starter. Mullins can, be, uh, can sling it and averages to 248.1 uh, yards per game. But as he's 12 touchdowns and 12 interceptions last year uh, assisted and 25 uh, touchdowns to 22 interceptions for his career he can be his own worst enemy but he gives his team a chance off the bench and as Eagles rookie head coach Nick Sh Nick Shannery has made known he wants competition Millen's added Millen's addition will do that me personally and it's the same with CJ Befford um, honestly with those guys no word of a lie you can say they were trained enough I don't think they were trained enough because Jimmy G was a man, nothing's going to happen to Jimmy G, blah, blah, blah. At the end of the day, they, those two was our backups. Sad, yes, interceptions, there were a lot of interceptions, but them two alone did us well to try and get us through the season, to be fair. And uh, with Nick Mullins was the same. He tried his best, did what he can, and that's it. Um, hopefully he does well. Um, I hope he, um, you know, does well for the Eagles. He deserves it, really. He did uh, well with our team. Sadly, we had to let him go. But it is what it is. And now he's got a team with the Eagles. So, yeah, proud of that. Good man. I hope he does well. Um, but you guys, you tell me. Do you think it was a good, you know? Do you reckon it was good for us? Do you not reckon it was good for us? Do you reckon this is a good move to the Eagles? Or do you not reckon it's a good move to the Eagles? Leave your comments, guys. Tell us down below. My thoughts, like I said. He tried his best with us. It is what it is. Uh, season was bl blurry anyway. But I thought he did well. Glad to see he's got a team. Hopefully not, uh, the uh, Eagles can push him, try and do as much as he can out of him because he's actually, he, he's not too bad really, but hopefully they can get more out of him. Uh, yeah, like I said, leave your comments down below. Tell us what you think. And um, yeah, um, subscribe guys. If you're subscribed new, uh, thank you very much for the 38 subscribers as well. I'm really fortunate, humble and privileged. Um, of you guys that have uh, subscribed, and like I said, you're new, subscribe. We've been a lot more 49ers news and gaming streaming. I've done one game of streaming because the sound didn't work and I'm very close. I've got the sound working, but I ain't got the headset working, but I am getting there. So I might do a test run tomorrow, tomorrow night or Friday night to get the things done. Um, but yeah, thanks for guys for watching once again and I'll see you guys uh, on the next video.